The craft beer industry is thriving, and having attended and been a part of many brew festivals in the last several years all over the globe, it's getting harder and harder to determine what makes one beer fest different from the next. I recently had the pleasure in documenting the West Coast Invitational Beer Festival in my hometown, the capital city of California, Sacramento. There was a crowd of thousands of craft beer lovers waiting in line, with first timers to vets of the festival consisting of friends, family, and favorite pooches. I couldn't wait to see what this beer festival had to offer on this day of epic craft beer festivities. A good way to start it off is always talking with the events volunteers. I'm Scott Mills and I've been working on the West Coast for six years now. It's a great event, great people. All the beer vendors are fantastic, uh, the events run professionally, and I love this place, it's great. As the beer enthusiasts continued to pour in, I couldn't help but feel the positive energy and vibes surrounding me. I knew this festival had something special happening. This was going to be a truly unique experience. My beer fest experience was about to be forever changed. At this point, I thought it would be a good time to chat with the owner of the event, Matson Brickley. This is the 17th year we've been out here in Sacramento doing a beer festival. And I gotta say, this is one of the most amazing years I've ever had for a lot of reasons. Not only was the quality of beer that we had here, the 50 invited breweries, the best we've ever seen, the beer they were bringing was top, top notch. It wasn't just the average thing you're gonna find on tap. It was some high quality, some of their best premium beers, some great award winning beers. And of course, as always, we do this unlimited festival with unlimited tasting for all of our guests. Cheers to West Coast beers! I've been here almost five years now doing this event. I mean, it's an awesome event. The fact that, you know, the money goes to charity makes it even better. I'm Craig Deleuze. I am uh, president of the Robla Elementary School District Board of Trustees. I'm also a board member for the Robla Education Foundation, which actually is the beneficiary of the West Coast Invitation. I was totally stoked that I was drinking craft beer and all for a great cause. It was wonderful to see that others felt the same way. West Coast Brew. Cheers. We've come many times over the years. Wonderful event. If you're not here, you don't like beer. Salud. This is something you should never do is let this glass run out. There's so many breweries here. What a great time. Family friendly. This is how you spend a Saturday afternoon, guys. With Cheers. friends, family, and a whole lot of beer. Cheers. Cheers. Again. I gotta get more. So here the weather, you know, it was one of those years where the weather could have been uh, a little bit off, but we decided to go for it anyway, no matter what people asked, and it worked out great. You know, God loves beer, the beer gods were on our side, and it made it for an incredible event. All this delicious craft beer drinking had gotten me hungry, and oh boy, what a fantastic lineup of premium fresh foods to choose from. Where do I start? <laughs> Let's see. Um... G Dubs Barbecue and cheers to Brew Talk TV and West Coast Beer. And Madison Blankley for having us. Oh, with my belly now quite satisfied, I was starting to ponder how all the charitable proceeds would be used. We raise money because, you know, when I went to school, things like field trips and science camp and things like that were paid for by the school. Well, nowadays, it's not. And students have to come up with that money themselves. And a large percentage, in fact, over 80% of the students in our school district are, are, are low income. So what we do is we raise money so that they're able to, to be able to be a part of events like that, things like science camp and, and field trip and, and then things like that. So we appreciate all those who came out to support the West Coast Invitational because you know, you're not just having a good time, but you're also benefiting kids and giving them an opportunity and experiences they otherwise wouldn't have. So thank you and please keep coming out. I kept feeling like I needed to wake up from this craft beer festival dream. Is it a dream? Am I sleeping? No. As the craft beer was flowing, live music was blaring, the good times were rolling. Smiles and award-winning beer were infinite on this day. It was hard to imagine needing much more. There was handcrafted knickknacks to buy from boutique vendors and hand-rolled cigars to puff on that complemented my beer. 
Talking with event goers, it was amazing how many people had come from all over the United States to attend this beer fest. So I came all the way down from Washington just for this event. Thanks, Madsen. Cheers to West Coast Invitational. Woo! West Coast Brew Fest, awesome, awesome, awesome. Thank you, Madsen. Thank you, Luisa. Thank you, everybody that's putting this on, all the volunteers. You guys rock. As the alcohol consumption increased, the fun meter started to peak. So I think it's safe to say that this beer fest recipe is gourmet. All the ingredients are local, organic, and fresh. Award-winning craft beer, smiles and laughter from all patrons, the perfect place in nature on a beautiful day next to the water, live music, delicious food, friends and family enjoying life's greatest gifts, good beer, and good times. So if any beer fest planners are watching, take a note from this recipe of greatness and give your guests the best experience you can. Cheers to all the epic craft beer and all the people I encountered on this lovely day in May. Hopefully next time I will see you there doing what I do, drinking local craft beer with local people, building community while giving back to that community all at the same time. Cheers to West Coast Beer Invitational. Cheers to Brew Talk TV. I just want to give a shout out to Brew Talk. Uh, hey, thanks for coming out here and filming everything. Uh, West Coast Beer, that's where it's at. Cheers to West Coast Beer! We really appreciate everybody coming out, everybody being a part of this, from our volunteers. Uh, which who are just incredible. They, they from the morning to the evening, being here and setting up. You can see them behind us working and cleaning up. To the brewers who come out here to be a part of this, I want to share all their wares. To everybody who comes out just to support this, and all for the good cause of the Robo Education Foundation. We couldn't ask for a better day. It's a Saturday, and we're out here enjoying beer, and it's all for you. The Roble Education Foundation and the Roble Elementary School Board of Trustees says cheers to the West Coast Invitational. Thank you so much.